Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, we will be looking in the four most basics, loading the dataset, going over the first few rows. So let's get started. First, I have added the data file for the car evaluation dataset, which we downloaded from here, the UCI repository. Once done, I'll just add some sections before we get started. First is the, let's name it prepare, preparation or prepare problem. Next, let me add the load in libraries. Now we will load pandas and all this. The other libraries we will be adding as and when needed. Next, we'll add a section for loading the dataset, load dataset. Let us import this data. Okay, let me first make sure. Okay. Now, if you go to TOC, you see appropriate alignment. Okay. Now go to files, right click, copy path, paste. So this is the file path. I'll do pd dot read csv. Now the read csv is a method provided by pandas out of the box. And it does this. It reads a common separated value or a common separated value file into a data frame. There are multiple parameters that you can pass. I'll provide the link in the description so you can check out all the parameters that it has support. Now for our use case, we'll be just passing the path, file path. And if you remember, the data does not have any column names. Hence, we'll do header equals none. Now, I'll just do data.head. And you can see the top five columns, the top five rows. Now, if you remember, uh, we don't, or since you already know the column names, we can pass that column names into our data frame. So this is the page. We have these three and three, six attributes and one class. So we'll be adding column names, calls equals. I'll copy all of them. This, this, this. We'll find. Pass these columns in the names attribute. If I run this, you can see all of the column names are added successfully. Now, this is all what we needed to do in this video. In the next video, we will try to summarize our data. So, thanks for joining in. Bye bye.